This is Mags on Media reporting all the big brand communication stories every week right here on ENCA. <laughs> well, he just keeps churning them out, doesn't he? Leon Schuster's latest comedy, Shucks, Your Country Needs You, will hit cinemas at the end of this month. All part of a marketing strategy, Schuster is now giving his fans the opportunity to show him what they got by producing their own pranks. A news now of a major global brand, the world-famous Hard Rock Cafe will soon be extending its brand to South African shores. Some impressive numbers here, 171 venues in 54 countries. The brand is going to open its first local restaurant before the end of the year, and it will be situated at the Mandela Square in uh, Santon here in Johannesburg. With me now is Area Vice President, Antonio Bautista. Welcome, thank you very much uh, for joining us. I've just mentioned 171 venues, 54 countries. It's an established brand. Boy, you've certainly taken your time getting to South Africa. Why? That's right, Jeremy. First of all, thank you for inviting us over here. We're very excited to finally arrive in the country. Uh, the reason we took uh, all this time is basically location-based. We were waiting for the right partner and the right location, and certainly Mandela Square is it's, it's a perfect, uh, the perfect location for us. What does a perfect location mean in terms of a brand like Hard Rock? Um, it, we, we always look for what we call ground zero in every city, and obviously you, you want to have great food traffic, good visibility, and an area where both locals and visitors are likely to go by on a daily basis. And I think Mandela Square embodies that. And Talk a little bit about the brand itself. It's an iconic global brand. The, 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 the traction, the public resonance, why does it work so well? Well, I think uh, the, the secret of hard rock is the music. I mean, we are based uh, uh, um, around music and, and music is, is perpetual. You never get tired of it. That mixed with amazing food, great service in, in a fantastic atmosphere uh, does the trick. But how do you match the music to a particular restaurant? Is that a science and a brand art in itself? And, um, not really. I mean, we, we, we look at music globally. Mm. Uh, certainly, we look at our partners to, to, uh, to customize some of, the, some of the music within the local market. So we will be talking to our local partners here, and we will be able to put a certain amount of music which would be more market-driven, but yeah. generally, uh, you know, you have a global appeal in music today, so rock and roll is pretty mm. universal, and artists all around the world are, uh, are very well recognized. Mm. Who's the typical customer? Well, anywhere from a 10-year-old kid mm. to a 50-year-old man like me. So we don't, I mean, uh, we, we look, uh, uh, we are a multi-dimensional space. You have, we're a family restaurant, but we also have a bar where you can come for a drink. We turn into a club on many occasions. We have live music. So we really try to appeal to a broad spectrum of consumers. Where did the brand start? London, 1971. and uh, All those years ago, yeah. Yes, <laughs> many, many years ago. And in fact... We were a, still young men. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> as a fun fact, uh, the yeah. first landlord gave us only a lease for six months. Yeah. So 42 years later, we're still there. But that was the first hard rock. Yeah. And fast forward to now, mm. 55th country. 172nd Hard Rock in Johannesburg, Mandela mm. Square. And lots of labor and love as far as the cocktails are concerned. Eh? Uh, that's, that's, too. The, that's, that's the brand hallmark. Really. Correct. Yeah. I mean, we, have, uh, we, 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 we are very well known for, for our drinks, great margaritas. We have Long Island iced teas. Our signature drink is probably the Hurricane, which is a great 24-ounce drink with rum, amaretto, juices. Definitely, definitely worth yeah. trying. You've had a few of those yourself, have you? I, I have to confess I did, yes. <laughs> Tell us about the guitar. I mean, it, it's all about the memorabilia. You talked about taking a piece of the Hard Rock Cafe away with you. I mean, again, that's become a famous brand extension, hasn't it? The, the retail started in 1988, actually, and it was one of those happy coincidences. So we didn't start selling retail. Today is a very significant component of our businesses, and we will have 110 pieces in this cafe which have been selected by our team, some of which are going to be from local artists too. I'm not going to disclose who they are at this point because we will have a sneak preview for the media and I hope you come where we will show you all the, all the memorabilia we have in this uh, location. Quite and unique. Doors open fairly shortly, huh? Just We'd like to, yes, before the end of the month we should be open. Antonio Bautista, thank you very much indeed, and good luck with the project. Thank you good for having me you. here. Now, here's an ad that uh, we think uh, might be replicated here in South Africa, given our massive problems with the alcohol addiction. It's from Finland, and it's for a non-profit organization called Fragile Childhood, trying to build awareness and reduce the country's high alcohol consumption statistics. Take a look at it. It is guaranteed to shock you.
Well, certainly it's a powerful piece of work that uh, hits home a very important message. Coming up on Mags on Media, an advertising agency gives up its offices for a client and some big brand trend spotting for 2014. <laughs> that moves. ENCA.com.